Welcome to ManyWho. In this video, I'll show you some of the cool apps you can build using the Twilio API with the ManyWho platform. Twilio is a service that allows you to create phone-enabled applications, so for the purpose of this demo, I'll show you how easy it is to build a voice-to-text app. I'm logged into the ManyWho Builder. To get started, just click on the flow you want to work on. Here's one I already started. I'll create some new screens, which will be read out to the user because this is for a phone, so they will act more as instructions when someone calls. Simply drag in a step and give it some content. You'll see that in this step, I've added instructions for when someone calls the phone number associated with this app. There are two options presented, one to record a message and two to send a text message. This is what the caller will hear. Keep this simple as Twilio will take care of the rest. Let me demonstrate some things you can do with the Twilio API using our Layout Builder. As an example, I'll have Twilio read us a message in a woman's voice. This will ask the user to press 1 to record a message. And I'll add a cowbell effect just for fun. Back on the Builder page, I'll add the new page I just created. And let's see how it works by calling the number associated with this app. Hello. Thank you for calling my Twilio app. Press 1 to record a message. Press 2 to send a text message. Are you sure you want to record a message? I'll play a cowbell while you think about it. Press 1 if you're sure. There's so much more though. Let me show you how the user can play back what they recorded. I'll add another page layout and choose My Recording. Once the caller has finished recording their message, it will be saved and transcribed. I can then drag a new page over, select the page we just created, connect it to the flow, and indicate that the user should press 1 to record. Next, I'm going to add a text message element to the app so that the caller can approve the message. I'll drag over a message element and then add a new action, and I'll choose send a text message. And then add the content of that message. And I've already added some outcomes for a rejected or accepted text. So if the call's approved, it will follow the path of approval if it's rejected, it will follow the rejected path. I'll activate this and we'll call the number and try it out again. Hello. Thank you for calling my Twilio app. Press 1 to record a message. Press 2 to send a text message. Are you sure you want to record a message? I'll play a cowbell while you think about it. Press 1 if you're sure. Please record your message after the beep. Welcome to my really cool app. Please wait while we process your request. Thank you for your recording. We capture the following. Welcome to my really cool app. It works as it did before, but when I send my response back as a text message, you can hear that I approved the recording. Approved. This is just one type of app you can build using the Twilio API with ManyWho, but you can build other types of apps with any number of services too. Thank you for watching. Drag, drop, and don't stop.